Hello and welcome back to Ruin. We have been told by Miss Karna to buzz off, and so we'll buzz off. Take in the beauties of this coastside town. Where should we go first? Hmm. As I say, and as Estelle would definitely do it, we should visit the church first. A Furby, it's her favorite place. You don't say, okay? That's not necessarily a, a female thing, you know? Us guys can enjoy a nice sunset from time to from time to time. We just don't admit it. So here's Sigaro. And there's Ligaro. Of course. We'll probably meet Figaro somewhere. He's the main attraction. Ooh, a casino, huh? Well, I got news for you, buddy. We, uh... <laughs> we killed one of them. It was really easy. No sweat. He didn't even get to do anything. He just bounced around a little bit and all of a sudden, he's dead. Sounds like our kind of place. You do you sell stuff? Yes. A salmon munier. I I have one already. But I don't have a city of rose. Okay, let me buy one of the Let me buy one of the rose, which is also a cocktail, apparently. Sounds tough, man. Looks like a hard life. Reopen in time for the Queen's birthday, which means it's not open yet, right? Yes. Why is it open? Enjoy a little nice view up there. Right. Nothing to see here except for the scenery. Alright, we've seen the church, we've seen the Bracers Guild, and we have seen... My guess is that if we go to the drawbridge, we'll proceed. But let's look around just a little bit longer. Oh, hi. No, not a, a word of thank you here. We, uh, your rescuers, to your saviors. My guess is airships. Airships. Or the power of friendship. That that's quite a 
quite a spin that you did there, Muriel. Damn you, history. Why is, are you so wrong? Airships. Nope. Oh. They just piled junk. I call it that the, uh, the neat method. It's a, it's a method that I myself employed quite frequently in my apartment back in the days. And they know nothing. See, you, okay. Um, Hotel Blanche. Oh yeah, where is the view of ocean in this room, huh? Got some explaining to do. I guess that's a window there, so I'll give that a pass. Ooh, downstairs. Where is the view, huh? Is this the ocean? False advertising. Also, quite frequent in the fantasy world. Yes. Okay, let's go back up. Uh, I want to... Okay, I'm gonna go to the Orbo factory real quick. Because I should have enough to open a slot, I believe. Not enough for Joshua, but certainly enough for Estelle. Do I want this one or this one? So right now it doesn't really matter. I'll open this, and let's see what cords we have. I would also like to upgrade some of this stuff that I have, so actually I will buy an action 2 quartz. Which means I can't buy that, it's fine. It's a little too expensive for my taste. When does attack 2 quartz come in? What about defense 2 quartz? Yeah, they're not here yet. P cut 1. Hmm, I don't think I need it. Right, I think that's good for now. I'm going to equip them. You know, I, I don't know if these are actually useful. That would be nice. Uh, maybe just a regular attack one core. Well, it's, maybe it's not. Okay, we'll put that on her for now. And for Joshua, I will replace this. There are better thing I can use for hit. Hellgate, Shadow Spear. Both of those sounds like good things. Okay, which is Eagle Eye is probably much more useful. 
So we'll put that on Joshua. Still, I think that's fine for now. Okay, thank you, sir. Racer skilled on the other place I haven't been to are the two shops. Let's go to the shop just to see what kind of merchandise we have. I'll buy it. I don't know if I have it already. No, I have it already. I do would like to sell all of my tear bombs, which because they're useless. They're useless since I have so many, you know, food that I haven't had a chance to, to enjoy yet. Um, she sells items, which means that the other person all the way across town should sell weapons. And I would like to see what he has. Or she, in this case. It's a very good staff. Also a very good pair of knives. A bow spike. Oh, that's right. Um, I was going to check. Yeah, I put I put the battle suit on Joshua instead of the cell. That's fine. I'm gonna spurge a little bit here. We'll buy a set of base lards, and then we'll buy a shield vest. Double spike can wait. I'm not made out of money, you know? We're in this bracer business to uh, help people, not to make a profit. But of course, we will make a profit whenever we can. That will give you the base arts. Yeah, that, that attack difference, man. It's, Nothing to scoff at. Sell it. Sell all of these. Uh, I hope they come back with better weapons. A bear assault. It's I can't sell bear assault. I just can't do it. The leather jackets. A couple of these boots. Maybe work boots as well. Okay. I made up most of my money back. Hi there. Uh, we are not meant to know about this. If we were, she would not have said, you know what? Always good to have a model, I say. Okay. Enough walking around. We are heading to the drawbridge. I can't figure out how to get there. Looks like a printing machine. Have to erase it. In other words, magic. 
Magic. Let's go to the other side. No, that's... Gang, why do you turn me around? We're here to look for unsavory people. That's the attraction, I believe. Hmm, nothing here. Akarosa bar. Yeah, that's a good way to look at life. It always could be worse. Well, your name means fish. So it only makes sense that you like to fish. A salubrious oatmeal. Man. Hungry just thinking about that word there. Does that mean we can fish? Hi, Simon. I remember you. Where's Milano? Oh, was it Murano or Milano? I think I remember her name just because of the cookie. Sounds like that's a place for us to go. Chief Portos. Interesting. And this, my friends, must be the room at the warehouse district. Why? Warehouses are cool. Of course, that's not how it works in real life because air transportation, it's so much more expensive. But in this particular game, you know, since orpments are essentially magic, hey bud. Now I'm curious. You want to talk again? Go already. Okay. Doesn't look like we can do anything further here. Oh. They probably should have asked us that question. Joshua killed him. Uh, Rise, you're scaring me. I got a, I got a friend back home. I could, uh, you know, to hook you up with. Yeah, that's. 
Very gentlemanly of you. Hey, that's rude. He's obviously a bird. Yeah, let's just kill them. Kill them all. Kill them now. Please, do it. Let me do it. Just let me do it. Is that the first time somebody in this game caught a style a hottie? I wonder. That's so cool! Well, he accomplished just that, my friend. Yes, stop with all this delinquency. Is that the mayor? And what is he doing here? I guess, you know, that's kind of our benefit of not looking like bracers. It's kind of like, you know, almost like undercover cops. You hear the darnest things. They're not exactly undercover. These guys are just dumb. Yes, and then you glasses. Well, I guess they're very respectful for not looking at her chest. He's a murderer. Thanks for asking. Things got it. I wonder who that is. Is that Karna? <laughs> Nothing like threaten somebody and then run away immediately. How do you do, Mayor Dalmore? I've got work just for you. Now chase down those brats and give them a good beating. 
I'll pay you 500. What's it? What is it? Money? Mira? Yeah, 500 Mira per bruise that you, you put on their faces. Chloe rinse. Dean Collins, okay. Must be the Dean of the Academy. The connections run deep in this part of the country. Interesting. And lost, I presume. What are you gonna do? Like they said, you're just going to call the Bracers Guild. So why would they need to tell you anything? Anyway. Oh, don't worry, Chloe. It's, uh, we came here by ourselves. You're just following us. But if you, oh, if you really want to lead us, this can be arranged. No, it cannot. Forget I said anything. Okay, we're gonna go back to the Bracers Guild. And find out if these people have anything new to say. It's John. Yeah, we are the new promising recruits that you were talking about. Pleased to meet you. I feel like Estelle is starting to pick up a little bit of the, um, let's say, way of speaking, a mannered way of speaking. Hey Chloe, you want an autograph? We can sign your bird if you want. Now we have quests to turn in and money to collect. Seems like all of the branches are shorthanded right now. Is there a problem with recruitment? Maybe they're not giving enough scholarships.
Hmm. Interesting. Undercover. I would like to request that you wipe them out. Leave no one alive. Bring me their hats. That's proof that you've done the deed. But they don't wear hats. Make them wear hats. Once in my life, I feel wanted. Everybody's always leaving. Oh, I thought they traveled back in time into like, you know, one well, of those uh, old fashioned filters in the 70s. 70s. They go any further with black and white. Are you leaving us, Chloe? Oh, drawbridge. I'm not exactly impressed. I mean, for magic, it looks really rickety. And that's the 30 minutes of dark hour, or the dark half an hour in this case, over at the World House District, because nobody can reach them. They can do anything they like. They're already filled up. Are you gonna follow us to the hotel room too, Chloe? I mean, you're a nice girl and everything, but we're not ready for this kind of thing yet. Okay, let's go back to the guild to pick up some quests, perhaps? Not a whole lot of quests going on right now. Let's turn everything in. Yeah, the lighthouse quest didn't even put up the board. Um, which is not surprising because the old man... ...would never make it all the way over here. Yay. I don't know about injury, but we did achieve our goal, that's for sure. Right, let's look at this haze quartz here. Enemies become unaware, unaware presence. Um, I wonder if that's on the battlefield or if that is... I don't want to, to do that, because 
I don't know what to do. Yeah, Joshua's quartz requirement gets a little more difficult because he has two slots that requires time quartz. And I don't the only other time quartz I really have it's this death blow. And it's useless. Well it's useful as a crutch, but it's useless. Hey, there are a lot of people up here. I'm up earlier. He kept, he kept opening the box every single time they told him not to open it. I can't understand Melvin. Arna. Two people at the entire guild. It's just bad. I mean, in Roland, we had like, what, one, two, three, four. Roland's a tiny little town. At Cassius, we had Shara, we've had that other guy whose name I forgot. And then we had us. So there's like five people. Why can't they find anybody in Ruin? Doesn't make any sense. Okay, I guess we will go ahead and check in at the hotel in the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you next time.